Imagine a place where dreams are turned into reality, where creativity knows no bounds, and where temples become works of art. Welcome to the enchanting city of Chengrai, where timeless wonders await. Today we invite you on a captivating journey to discover the beauty of the white and blue temples. First, we will explore the white temple, a gleaming masterpiece that radiates purity and spiritual awakening. Marvelous hero heads are here. Next, we find ourselves in front of the mesmerizing blue temple, a newer addition to Chengsrai temple scene that offers a calm and peace. And lastly, we get to taste the best-selling food in Chengrai. This is the White Temple. The first thing that captures the eye is the stunning exterior of the White Temple. Its pristine white surface, adorned with its carving and shimmering music mirrors, creates an aura from another world. As you step inside the temple, another highlight emerges the vibrant morals that adorn its sacred walls. These intricate artworks, blending with the traditional Buddhist theme, resulting in a mesmerizing visual narrative that sparks curiosity. Remember, the original temple on the site was in a state of despair and not suitable for use. So Tsalam Chai decided to demolish and rebuild it from scratch. In 1997, the artist wanted to create a temple that would stand for its offering to Lord Buddha and serve as a center for Buddha teaching and meditation. He used his own funds to finance the construction. The artist in interview said, the white temple is not just a temple, it's an offering to Lord Buddha and a symbol of purity. I wanted to create a place where people could experience the divine beauty and contemplate the essence of enlightenment. As you approach the temple, you need to cross a bridge known as the Cycle of Rebirth. The bridge is guarded by dragons and hands reaching upward from the sea of despair and anguish. Crossing the bridge symbolizes the journey from the Cycle of Birth, Death and Rebirth in Samasra, the Cycle of Existence, and that is towards spiritual enlightenment and liberation. The central building of the White Temple is the Upasit where Buddhist ceremonies and rituals take place. The Yupset is adorned with beautiful murals that depict traditional Buddhist teachings, as well as modern elements like Superman, Batman, and other iconic characters. Those are reflecting the artist's intention to bridge the gap between traditional and modern art. It's worth noting that the White Temple has become an iconic landmark, not only in Chiang Rai, but also in Thailand as a whole. Its uniqueness and artistic brilliance have drawn attention of the tourists worldwide. Popularity has contributed to the growth of tourism in Chiang Rai, attracting significant number of visitors from all the corners of the globe. Although we are not allowed to take photos and videos inside the Ubisoft, but the interior walls of the temple features interact and mesmerizing mural paintings. These murals illustrate a fusion of traditional Buddhist narratives, recent events, and popular cultural references. The artwork is elaborate and vibrant with detailed scenes that include images of heaven, hell, and the journey towards enlightenment. Don't get sunburned, be prepared. It's really hot here. Not very far away, we get to the Blue Temple. It was constructed on the grounds of an older temple that had fallen into disrepair. The renowned Thai artist, Kip Kao, initiated the project in 2005 with an aim of restoring the existing temple and creating a unique place of worship. It is much smaller than the White Temple and just very short drive away. The construction of the Blue Temple took several years to complete. It was officially opened to public in 2016. Although it is relatively a new addition to the region's temple, it has gained attention for its distinctive design and serene ambience. Like many Buddhist temples, the Blue Temple serves as a place for worship, meditation, and religious ceremonies. It is dedicated to the Buddha and houses a large white statue of the meditating Buddha inside the main hall. While the Blue Temple may not be as well known as the White Temple, it has been gaining popularity among tourists and locals alike. Its unique style, vibrant blue color, and peaceful atmosphere what attracted visitors, seeking a different temple experience in Chiang Rai. The stairs to the main entrance are guarded by Naga serpents. In Buddhism, Nagas play a significant role 
and folklore and religious symbols. They are believed to be protectors of the Dharma, and they are associated with the elements of water and rain. Nagas are also considered powerful beings who can gift blessings and provide spiritual guidance. Like most of Thai temples, the walls depict stories of the life of Buddha, but these have been painted in particularly modern style. Much of this art mounted in ornate gold frames, which fit tastefully with the rest of the theme. The centerpiece of the space is a seated Buddha statue, made of a shiny white porcelain and had the blue in reflection of the room, powerfully framed by columns. He sits with one hand pointed to the ground, a representation of the moment when he achieved the enlightenment. While this temple may not be widely known as other attractions in Chiang Rai, visitors can enjoy a more peaceful and intimate experience, free from large crowds, allowing for more personal connection with the temple and its surroundings. The shops around the temple are cool. You can try the ice cream with sticky rice. And the blue color ice cream at the blue temple. Now that we're done with the temples, it's time to eat. We asked our guide to let us try something traditional, and he recommended cow soy. Cow soy is a traditional northern Thai noodles dish that is known for its rich and flavorful broth. It's made with egg noodles and combination of tender meat that is typically garnished with crispy noodles, pickled cabbage, shallots, and squeezes of lime. This unique blend of spices and construct of texture make cow soy a favorite among locals and visitors alike. The last on the list of Shanghai seafood soup. Crystal noodles with seafood. This is great. It's very hot. So, this egg noodles dish served in a rich and fragrant curry like broth. The broth is made with a combination of coconut milk, curry base, and spices, giving it a creamy and flavorful base. The dish is commonly topped with tender pieces of chicken or beef, or maybe tofu and veggies for vegetarians. This concludes the trip we had to the Blue and White Temple. We still have a lot more to discover in Thailand. Stay tuned and thank you for watching. I came to see the black house on this side, but I found something quite more interesting. This plant. It's massive.